Hello everyone, uh, thanks for stopping by my channel. Uh, today we're going to be painting a clown colored jerk bait. Uh, I've gone ahead and already put a white base coat on our jerk bait. Uh, the first thing we're going to be doing is using a pearl silver made by Cretex uh, for the first layer on the jerk bait. So I've gone ahead and uh, heat set it once. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and put on a second layer. Uh, just a quick note for the video, I will be cutting out all of the uh, heat sets that I'm using uh, just to speed up the video. So for the next color, we're going to be using a uh, fluorescent yellow. And for this, we're just going to be doing the tops and the bottom and uh, a little bit of the tail. Flip the bait around. This way we can get a cleaner position on the bottom. little bit up on the sides here. Okay. So the next color we're going to be doing is uh, just a standard opaque red. And uh, we're just going to paint the head red uh, kind of back to the gill plate in a little bit further back. Make sure we get the throat. Just quickly flip the bait around. Okay. 
All right, so that's my uh, take on uh, the clown pattern. Uh, really simple. Uh, it's a really easy beginner's pattern to, to do. It's literally just three colors. Uh, doing the more elaborate colors can be really rewarding, but doing these really simple ones honestly are just really relaxing, and it's uh, a nice change of pace from having to do you know six, seven, eight colors. So uh, really enjoy doing these simple patterns every now and again. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and pop some eyeballs on this guy and uh, get get it clear coated, and we'll be all set. Okay, so I've gone ahead and got the eyeballs on. Um, again, one of the really nice things about doing these really simple patterns, it's really fast. I was able to knock out both of these guys in about 20, 25 minutes, uh, doing them, you know, just concurrently. So uh, last step is to put some clear coat on these and uh, we're all set. For clear coating, I use a 30 minute uh, DoveCon two ton epoxy.
So here's our finished product. I went ahead and put some size four hooks on there. Uh, for jerk baits, I really like doing a feathered hook on the end. Uh, I really think it makes it uh, flash in the water. So turned out pretty well. I don't really have any gripes. So uh, again, a really simple color scheme for uh, beginners and uh, even for the seasoned people that have been painting a while. Uh, I really like doing these simple patterns because it really uh, is really relaxing. There's really not that much can, that can go wrong with it. So uh, thanks everyone for stopping by. I really do appreciate the view. Thank you.